It's a seminal film, Alien, not just in the genre of sci-fi and horror, but in the whole of filmmaking. Director Ridley Scott has bluntly described it as a Texas chainsaw massacre of science fiction, featuring truckers in space. Superbly cast, with the added genius of securing Sigourney Weaver as Ellen Ripley, who was really only known at the time as a stage performer, which did help to create tension on screen as her fellow cast already had plenty of screen experience between them. So much has been written and said about this masterstroke of tension and horror, but really part of the film's effectiveness comes from the fact that the audience can identify with the characters. Everyone on board the Nostromo is a normal, everyday working person just like the rest of us. They just happen to live and work in the future. But watching Alien today, it remains timeless and undated. Dealing with production budgets, Ridley Scott felt that some exterior locations appeared too small, so he had his two young sons and the son of the film's cinematographer stand in for the regular actors, wearing smaller spacesuits in some scenes to make the set pieces seem larger. Originally, the film was written to end on an earlier scene. However, the director negotiated to increase the budget and film the final sequence over a couple of extra days. That confrontation makes for a tension-filmed epilogue, leaving you with a sense of satisfaction without closing the door on any chance of a sequel, of which there have been many. Alien covers plenty of themes witnessed in earlier monster movies, but as screenwriter Dan O'Bannon said, he didn't steal the idea of Alien from anything, but rather, he stole it from everything. So, a must-see film on your next Fright Night at the Movies. Catch Alien on the big screen as it was meant to be seen.